Hello Spider Owners, Brandon here with SlingMods.com and today we have our LED afterburner taillight strips for the Canon Spider F3 and F3S. Introducing our afterburner taillight strips from the guys over at Trick LED. These LED strips light up the rear end of your F3, enhancing both the rear and side view visibility increasing your likeliness of being seen while out on the open road, whether it's during the day or at night. Now each strip is encased in a patent pending smoke tube designed for a stealthy look when the lights are off and feature 100% plug and play connectors for a straightforward installation. And they adhere into place with the included 3M VHB backing tape. Now allow me to walk you through the installation process. Start by unscrewing these four 8mm screws so you can take off your license plate. And then unscrew this T10 torque screw to remove this little door, exposing the harness we'll be plugging into later. Now take an 8mm Allen wrench and unscrew these four Allen screws holding the rear fender on. And then before you loosen the last two, make sure you slide something underneath the fender to prevent it from falling and hitting the ground. Then swing the fender out to the right hand side, exposing the back side of the fender. So that you can unscrew these seven, eight millimeter screws holding the outer plastic license plate cover on. Once that's out of the way, you can now lean the fender up against the tire, adding one of the Allen screws to hold it in place. Then go through and clean the four round support bars with the included alcohol wipe and let that sit for a minute to dry. Before going over the same service area with the included primer wipe. Now once that's dry, test fit the LED strips so that the longer ones go on the top bar with the wires meeting in the middle. Then starting with the long strip, peel off a small section of protected backing tape, line it up so that it's centered with the bar, and then press down firmly to adhere into place, removing small sections of protected backing tape as you go, and making sure that it stays centered on the bar. Then take the smaller LED strip and peel off a small section of backing tape, line it up so that it's centered on the bar, and then press down to adhere it in place, removing small sections at a time, adhering it to the bar as you go. Then just repeat that same process for the other side, making sure that you attach the longer strip to the top bar and shorter strip to the bottom bar with all the wires meeting in the middle.
Now take the 4 into 1 splitter and add a little dab of dielectric crease to each end and connect it to all four LED strips. Then plug it into the new OEM style harness. Next, unplug the harness that we exposed earlier that was located right behind the license plate and plug one end into the OEM style harness and then plug the other end back into the harness coming off the bike. Now you can turn on the ignition and double check to make sure all the LEDs light up. And if everything looks good, you can start reassembling the fender by carefully tucking in the wiring behind the cover. And be sure to remove that one Allen screw we used to hold up the fender during installation and pivot the fender out so you can tighten down the seven eight millimeter Allen screws, making sure not to pinch any wires. Then pivot the fender back into position, lining up the four holes on the swing arm and reinstalling the four eight millimeter Allen screws, mounting the fender back up to the swing arm. Now test the lights one more time and then tuck in the remaining wires so that you can reattach the access door with that T10 torque screw. And reattach the license plate with those four eight millimeter screws. Now if enhancing the looks and rear end visibility of your Can-Am Spider F3 or F3S is on your mod list, then be sure to head on over to slingmods.com today or click the link in the description below to grab a set of our LED afterburners for your spider. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so I can keep you up to date with everything spider. I'm Brandon, signing out, till next time.